Thriller YouTube, it's your boy Zigtech, and I'm back. I'm back with another review, and uh, this time it's the Pebble Smartwatch. Uh, it's the Pebble Smartwatch, and you can uh, basically pair this watch with your uh, iPhone and Android um, devices. Um, basically, I wanted to review this uh, product just to give you guys an idea. Should you go out there and buy one, or is the technology worth uh, spending money on um, a uh, smartwatch, uh, even even the expensive smartwatches? Is the technology uh, worth it? Um, so basically, um, we'll get into this right away. Uh, this uh, is the uh, smartwatch by Pebble. Um, it has plenty of uh, uh, watch faces you can download. It has its own companion app um, for iOS. I believe uh, Android is set to release uh, sometime uh, this month. Um, it's uh, basically what the app is. You can download a ton of apps. Um, it has a lot of remote apps. It has a lot of fitness apps. Um, it has a, just a lot of uh, uh, notification apps you can download. Um, I, we'll get into some of those in a second. Um, but this is some of the face plates that I had downloaded. And as you guys can see, it does have a backlit uh, LED. Uh, that so when you are at night, when you are somewhere that's dark, or you're at at night somewhere that you can. Uh, uh, you can basically view your watch uh, uh, very easily, and as you can see, I just got a text message. Um, so, just wanted to show you some of the face plates, guys. Uh, uh, this one is a Mickey Mouse face plate. I thought it was pretty cool because it shows you the graphics. Um, it shows you kind of uh, what the uh, Pebble Bowl is capable of uh, once a lot of developers get their hands on it. Um, and uh, basically, uh, with the watches, uh, right here is the home button. Um, as you can see, these little uh, these little circle uh, areas right here, uh, you will. That's where you would charge. Uh, it's a uh, USB uh, power charge. You would charge up this device. Um, it basically has a toggle up and toggle down button. And this would, uh, I guess, you would say this would be your uh, enter button. Enter button. Um, and it's like I said, it's, it, it's it's pretty decent, man. I like the technology. I think it's worth it, especially for somebody that's on the go, um, somebody that's always busy. Um, somebody that keeps the uh, foam in their pocket. Most most of us keep our foam in our pocket, so um, you know they definitely gives you that advantage to just go and check who's calling or, or what notification is coming in um, ASAP. So we get to the uh, apps. Um, you have your music app. Uh, you can go into this app and you can uh, press this middle button for play. Um, basically, what this does is uh, it plays any any uh, playlist or any uh, anything that's on your library that's on your on device. Any music that's on your library on your device, it plays. Um, this phone is um, also this phone is, has five ATM water resistance. So if you're in the bathroom in the shower and your phone's on the sink somewhere and you want to listen to some music while you're in the shower, hey. Go right ahead. That's your business. But uh, it's very handy uh, for a lot of musicians. That comes in handy. Um, if you just want to play something real quick, uh, you don't want to reach down in your pocket and grab your phone and unlock your phone and go through a hundred, whole bunch of stuff just to play a song. Um, also, it has notifications. Um, you can it, it notifies you on everything. Any ESPN app, guys, uh, Game Time app, um, ladies, any even for the ladies, any type of app you have synced uh with your uh, device, you will get that notification. You will get your email notifications. You will get your Facebook notifications. You will get all of your notifications. Now, can you reply to your notifications? No, but it's definitely it's it's just it's just a quick it's a quick site. Uh, you can just see what's going on in your phone real quick, and I think I, I and I love it. I like the notifications that comes through. Um, it, it, it's it vibrates. It, it has a really really distinctive vibration. Um, you won't miss uh, any uh, notifications with that vibration. Um, we get into some more of the apps. Uh, like I said, it has a ton of watch faces you can download. It has your settings. You can go in there and turn off the back LED or uh, set up set up uh, your uh, Pebble watch to your liking. It has Pebble GPS. It's basically a turn by turn GPS navigation, and it's free. Uh, I was trying it out the other day, and it works pretty good. Um, it has this uh, game called Petris. It's basically Tetris for uh, for the uh, smartwatch, um, it has a pedometer. Basically, what that is, it tracks your steps, uh, it tracks your calories, and so forth. Um, it has Yelp. Everybody know what Yelp is. Uh, it also has Pebble Flix. This is uh, basically a uh, app where you basically get to uh, check all the movie show times near you. And it also have a little game in here called Tiny Bird. You can download uh, tons of game guides. It has uh, I, I might have seen over 100 games uh, in the App Store. And you basically play Tiny Birds. It's basically a mock-up of uh, 
Flappy Birds and you just use this up button right here. You press up. And I, this game has been challenging. Basically passes up time if you're in a meeting or you're in a doctor office somewhere. And you basically, you, you don't want to, uh, you just want to pass up some time. You can just pop up uh, Tiny Birds and uh, basically get it in. Um, so, you know, uh, just as my review, guys, of the uh, Pebble Smart Watch, it's a really, really decent watch. Um, it's only $129. You can get it at your local Best Buy or you can get it online, Amazon, wherever you choose to buy it. It's only a couple of dollars. And it's basically, like I said, it's a mid-entry smart watch. Uh, and it basically gives you an idea of the technology, uh, you know, if, if and maybe if whenever uh apple does drop an iWatch watch or whoever else drops uh, and these you know this, these wearables are going to get really really popular uh the 2014 and um i'm impressed with it i i'm, I'm interested I'm, I'm curious to see other companies that are coming out with these wearable watch smart watches um um 